to record my first uh, crystal collection. I ordered this from Amazon and this is a protection set. It's a bulk of crystals. It came in this box. And when you take it out, this is the box it comes in. It's all scratch from right here. That's not supposed to be there, but it is there. But I'm not going to worry about it. Here are the crystals that are in here. Let me turn on the flash. Okay. So then it has this foam thing here. And when you remove it, it comes with this. These are all the sets that they have. And I have this one with the black one on here. And then it also has this little book. And this book, it tells you how to use them, how to clean them, which ones are in here, and what they are used for. So I'm going to show you how big they are and what they do. So the first one on the list here is this one. It's called Obsidian, which I don't know if I pronounced it right, but when you open this, it has like this... Oh, this wood smells like it's been perfumed, but it says absorbs undesirable energy, whether it originates from you, the environment, or others. So that's that one. The next one is fluorite, which I believe is this green one here. This one... It says highly protective, pre prevents psychic manipulation, blocks EMF pollution. I'm gonna have to Google that because I don't know what that is. And then, cell, cell night. It's this one. It says cleanses and protects the uh, aura and other crystals. Doesn't need cleansing itself. The one that I wanted is right here. The reason why I wanted this one is because um, this is the one that I read about that helping you manifest, so that's why I wanted this one really bad. And it has other um, things that I was like, okay, I really want this one. Uh, so, Malachi, I guess. Defense against energetic pollutants, pollutants, radiation, and other impurities. I, damn it, I don't know how to say none of this. Which I believe is this one. It's this black shiny one. <laughs> it's kind of metallic y. <sighs> Very grounding. Prevents in uninvited energies from entering the aura. That's hematite. And the next one is a mist. How pretty, huh? Purple one. I want the rose quartz one because I love pink. Powerful protector against psychic attack. Transforms destructive energy into pure light. Heals addiction. Yeah, I, this thing smells like it's been perfumed, but it smells nice. Okay, and this is tree agitate. This is a neat one. Which is funny how these are crystals because they look like rocks. Uh, guards against harmful emotions, keeps you safe, especially in nature. And here, this clear one. It has like some brown stuff in here. Or orange. Okay. <clears throat> Protects against all forms of negative negativity. Amplifies energies of other stones. Hmm. And then the last one, which is this one. It's a really neat one because it has like, it looks like there's glitter on here. It's so pretty. Kind of looks like a bark of a tree. Oh, some pieces falling off of it. Um, black tourmaline, if I'm saying that correct, 
Black Tourmaline is one of the most powerful protection stones on the planet. It places an energetic boundary between you and others, minimizing ne negative outside influences as well as increasing your vitality. It can protect you from the harmful electromagnetic fields associated with cellular phones and other electronic devices. Uh, placed in entryways, it can also seal any, any living or workspace with protective energy. This stone shields all of the chakras. I don't even know what that is. I'm going to have to Google that. Detoxifies the body and strengthens immunity. It will help you to ground yourself and feel safe. Hold it in your hand when needed or carry it in your pocket throughout the day. This one. I've never used crystals before. I don't even know how to have to use them. But it does give you, um, like, instructions here. Um, like I said, I am going to be carrying one of these with me in my purse. Which, it might be this one, because this is the one I wanted, but I'm not sure yet. But I'll have to see what the heck, shuck, whatever the heck that is, because I don't even know what that is. And, um, see how they can be cleansed. I still don't know where I'm going to put them. Um, the rest of them, like where in the world I'm going to place them. Because I don't know. I wish I had like a little dish. I would have to get like a dish for them. Unless I want to keep them like this. Because I don't want to spread them uh, and put them in random rooms. Because then my kids are just going to freaking grab them and, and misplace them. So I'm not going to do that. But that's what this looks like. It's really cute, small. I was expecting it to be bigger, but I didn't know crystals were. Um, this small but anyways that's my first little crystal collection we'll see what I get next I'll show you guys that as well but I'm really excited about these I can't wait to use them thank you for watching and let's see how this goes for me